Hello and welcome to Pursuit of Perfect System. Yesterday was a very interesting day. I went to Nintronics, the excellent hi-fi and AV dealership in Hertfordshire, as they was due delivery of the new Bowers & Wilkins 600 speaker range. If that wasn't exciting enough, Padood, the UK distributor for exclusive high-end brands such as Nagra, YG Acoustics, Boulder, Bel Canto, Arenda, was there delivering something very special and very hi-fi pornographic. They was installing a system worth over £400,000, comprising of YG Acoustic Sonya XV Junior speakers at the lofty £200,000 price tag. Nagra Electronics and a YG Acoustics hi-fi rack system. Kerry St. James of YG Acoustics had flown over from America to personally set up and install the system. Kerry is known around the world as one of the best in the business at setting up systems at this level. I was very fortunate to be there and capture this monumental task of assembling the modular YG acoustic speaker system. The first speaker section to be removed was the bottom bass section. I was stunned by the beauty of the style and finish of the speaker. It's impeccable and looking at the internals that are on display shows an amazing level of engineering precision. All the parts needed to assemble the speakers come in flight cases which just blows me away with this attention to detail. Speaking of attentions to detail, I'm extremely impressed with YG's method of moving these very heavy precious speakers. They've designed sliders and used big suction handles to pick up and move the speakers with ease. I get to see the base module top half removed from its crate by Kerry with the exact same care and attention to detail. It's equally stunning with its curved angles, clean lines and perfect finish. The Sonya XV speakers come in two main colours. Black is the usual finish, to have a silver finish is actually something quite rare and special. The quality of the drivers are seriously impressive when you consider they start as solid billets of aluminium. In-house, YG use advanced techniques to mill them down to an exact size, shape and weight, with the drivers having a structural bracing system milled into them, so the drivers act as pure pistons and don't flex or misshape when under pressure. At this point I get a phone call to let me know the Nintronics boys were unloading very first UK shipments of the Bowers & Wilkins new 600 speakers, so I shot round to take a look. Back into Nintronic's new main demo room, Kerry from YG had been busy. He had removed and assembled the mid-top and mid-bass sections of both the left and right speakers. This amazing system was now starting to take shape. Speaking of shapes, I was stunned by the subtle but stunning curves of the YG speakers. The shape of them just adds a lovely element of sophistication and class that is just breathtaking. YG have invested half a million dollar machinery with five axis milling capability that are able to create these stunning shapes from aircraft grade aluminium. All done in-house and to tolerances of one eight thousandth or less. Everything is exact, everything is precise, even the assembly of the modules has a specific method with bolts being tightened to an exact tension. I was very lucky to get a good look inside one of the modules. There was a lot to look at but also something very obvious missing. You can clearly see the exacting nature of the bracing structure of the speaker. 
What amazed me was the fact it's a hollow shell. There was no acoustical stuffing used. Kerry explained acoustical stuffing is used to compensate for certain inefficiencies of the cabinet design. YG use very little acoustical stuffing within their speakers. This allows air to flow more freely and provides a larger enclosure for their drivers to work in. Who could not be impressed with that level of engineering attention to detail? Before the last panel is assembled, Padud Managing Director George shows me the quality of one of the panels. Look how thick it is and again how amazingly well manufactured and finished it is. Now the speakers are assembled, I thought the system was taking shape when actually more had to be removed. The Nintronics boys removed the outstanding Quadraspire X reference racks to make way for the £40,000 YG Acoustics rack system. A rack designed and built in-house by YG Acoustics to withstand extreme levels of vibration and provide the perfect platform for sensitive audio equipment to sound their best. With the rack assembled, it was time to start unpacking and installing the electronics from Nagra. The Nagra HD preamp up close is just gorgeous. Made in Switzerland, it has a watch-like precision to its look and finish. Power supply bottom section and preamplifier top section are separated by a ceramic bearing so no vibration can pass from one to the other. The Nagra preamplifier has independent controls for the left and right channel gains. To guarantee the exact same volume level is set on both channels, it has a lock feature which auto corrects for the unadjusted gain. That is just amazing. Once installed on the YG rack, the Nagra finish set off from the black background looks just beautiful. It's hard to find words to describe and I can only imagine what the pride of ownership might feel like for the lucky audiophile who buys hi-fi at this level. The Nagra HD monoblock amplifiers are installed and other Nagra electronics. Once everything was wired up and turned on, all there was to do was press play and relish in the glory of a system at this level. One of the best systems in the world in a dealer demo room of this quality. Come back for part two and experience some of that demo.